As we go to the fourth, it's our Yellowwood bringing the lumber feature. This man knows all about hitting the ball a long way. Thank you. Those are probably all when I was pitching too. There we go. That was Javi Lopez then. And here is Javi Lopez now. He hasn't changed a bit. Make sure Gladney had the <laughs> W that night. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> How have you been? Doing great. Doing great. Can't complain. And you look good. You look like you're at your playing weight. I did. I, uh, I actually lost 26 pounds the last month and a half. No kidding. Yeah. I had surgery in November, and all I did was eating the whole winter. <laughs> 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 and... Uh, I weigh myself 252. I'm like, uh-uh, that's it. Uh, summer is coming up. I, yeah, I got to lose this weight. So how did you do it? Besides Working out and diet. Working out and diet. Well, you look great. So, well, thank you. It's hard to do it, trust me. It's really hard to do it. And it seems like if I don't work out for three days in a row, I feel like I gained five pounds right away. Hard to lose and easy to gain. Well, you had to get in shape because you knew it was bobblehead night. That was the big thing. Exactly. That bobblehead, <laughs> right? Bikini weather coming up. There we go. <laughs> there we go. You had a good time today? Yeah, I had a great time. I brought my family with me. They're all having a great time. Uh, I don't get to see, you know, I don't, I don't get to do that all the time. So might as well brought the whole family. Well, it's great for you to come out to the ballpark. Everybody loves seeing you. And by the reaction, we were talking about the reception you got to throw out the first pitch. Still one of the all-time most popular players oh, thank here. Thank you. Thank you. And he threw a strike, too. I'm surprised yeah. I threw a strike. Yeah, yeah, he did. He threw it up all good. No kidding. So what's your fondest memory of playing here in Atlanta? Fondest memory? Yeah. I don't know. Uh, there's plenty. There's a lot of them. <laughs> 1995 World Series. That's pretty Without good. a doubt. Uh, I guess uh, the NLCS MVP, uh, uh, my... You know, great year in 2003. Um, and obviously catching three Cy Young Award pitchers. They, Tom says all the time he couldn't have done it without you. They completely spoiled me behind the play. See, then I went to, I went to Baltimore and I faced reality. <laughs> <laughs> Longoria took a close pitch, two balls, two strikes. We're visiting with Avi Lopez. Here at Turner Field, game tied 1 1. And Longoria now a full count. Do you watch much baseball these days? Are you able to? I I don't watch games, but I do catch up on, uh, you know, the result line, you know. Mm -hmm. Try to see what's the latest, latest update on baseball. Longoria is down on strikes. That's four strikeouts. For Williams Perez, Javi, from a catcher's perspective, what do you see from this young man? I'm sorry, who is it? Williams Perez. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I'm telling you, I half of the team, I have no idea who are they. Uh, you know, shame on me because of that. Because I, sh I, I should be, pl I should be no. paying more attention to no. the, the team. No, you're not <laughs> alone. We, pay, we pay a lot of attention, <laughs> and there's a lot of new faces. Yeah. Oh my. He's but uh, it's, it's, I mean, he's pitching great. He looks like he has pretty good stuff. He's Were you in spring training some? No. I didn't go this year. The last year? I did. Uh, Christian Bethancourt. Yes. What do you think of him? I work with him a little bit, and uh, he's a, uh, you know, potential, you know, great catcher. Uh, I work a little bit with him, you know, how to, you know, calling games, uh, blocking. Uh, I think he was having a little bit of a tough time trying to get his body as slow as he can. He couldn't, we couldn't get him low enough uh, to get so a lower big. target. Yeah. And um, I guess, uh, who was it? Uh, Baba worked with uh, the strength uh, and agility guy, trying to get him lower. And I don't know what happened after that. I, I, only, I only was there for a week. And, uh, well, when I left, they were working on him and try to get him, you know, a lot, you know, flexible. But you think he's got a chance to be a good one, good catcher? Well, he was doing great when I was there, and his arm is unbelievable. I mean, his arm was, 
if you don't make it as a catcher, I can see him being uh, 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 <laughs> a stopper. <laughs> Just like the, uh, what's the Dodgers, uh, Jensen? Yeah, okay. yeah, Jensen. Yeah. Yeah. Jensen, there we go. Because he's got a, a blessing arm, no doubt about it. James Loney walks with one out. That brings up Logan Forsyth. He bounced out second his first time up. Perez quickly ahead of him 0 2. I know this isn't your first bobblehead, right? Has there been one before when there you were There were two. Playing? Yeah. Yeah. I had two in the past when I was playing with the Braves. Okay, well they just kind of lined up all across your trophy case. Well, well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess. Uh, <laughs> now, do you have a favorite of the th of the three? Uh, I mean, how do you like well, this, this is one? Th this is a very special one because um, I have a whole ceremony about it. Um, the other two, I was just, you know, catching glavin while they were giving away bobbleheads. <laughs> Base hit by Logan Forsyth puts two men on with one out, and David De Jesus comes up. Jesus is the Tampa Bay left fielder. He's got 16 RBIs, and the Rays threaten to take the lead back here in the top of the fourth inning. Well, I know you can relate, Javi, to this guy making his first big league start and having a veteran catcher back there like A.J. Brzezinski. That's that should be, you know, a relief for him. All he have to do is just throw what he calls. Base hit to right. Marquez plays it on a hop, gets it back to the infield quickly. And now real trouble. Bases are loaded with one out. De Jesus now with hits in 12 of his last 14 games. And the Rays getting better cuts the second time through the lineup card. It's kind of what happened last night to uh, Mike fulton in the fifth inning. Got two outs and then a walk and a couple of hits led to two runs. Tonight it's one out and a walk. But Williams Perez in the soup right here. See if he can get that sinker for a double play ball off the bat of Asdrubal Cabrera. Cabrera's hitting the one double play this year. Plate, one ball, no strikes. Missed again, ball two. Sometimes on that change up, he really flies open to that front side and arm drags. Yeah, get arm side gets in a little bit of a hurry gets that yeah. front side out too fast and can't get back through over that front side. There's the ground ball Freeman's got it. There's one Perez to the bag double play and he spikes the baseball. Why not? <laughs> he got the ground ball he that needed awesome. a three six one double play. So visiting with Javi Lopez here at Turner Field. Javi, a former Oriole, as is Marquecas, who takes a called strike. Javi, this is a special year for the Braves again. John Smoltz is going into the Hall of Fame. Your thoughts on the uh, ageless wonder John Smoltz? <clears throat> I'm very happy for him. Uh, uh, you know, I have no doubt that, you know, he was going to make it. Um, he, 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 you know, catching all, I mean, catching him all these years, you know, without a doubt, he's one of the, you know, the, you know, one of the pitcher with the nastiest stuff I ever caught. And, um, and you know, small, you know, he, he's a very smart guy. He, uh, he put some numbers out there as a starting as a reliever. And, you know, without a doubt, he really deserved to be in the Hall of Fame. It's coming up in Cooperstown later this summer. The two strike pitch to Nick is skied towards center, and Kiermeyer is going to get it. There's out number one. That's yeah, pretty amazing when you think back at, at your career. 
the guys you caught in the era in which you caught them. I mean, it's it's just spectacular. Tommy, Maddox, John Smoltz, all three of those guys yeah. are all in the I Hall mean, of Fame. Today's now. day, I mean, when I caught them, I mean, they, you know, every time they, they, they pitch, they, they pitch at least, what, eight inning, nine inning? Today's days, you know, pitchers last, what, five, six innings, <laughs> they're gone. It's right? a different game, for sure. I know, and uh, change definitely, the, the game definitely changed. But um, Small, Maddox, and, and Glavin, definitely, they, they go all the way to the end pretty much every time they, they go out there. We've talked with Tom and John a lot because they've joined us for so many broadcasts about it was like pitching for Bobby Cox. As an everyday player, what was it like playing for Bobby Cox? Well, you don't realize how good of a manager, how good of a person he is until you play for another team and you start comparing. And that's what happened to me when I went to the Orioles. I mean, it doesn't mean the Orioles, you know, they treat me the best they could and great organization. Uh, but obviously, I start comparing, you know, brave Orioles. Sure. And there's no doubt, Paul, because we're, you know, superior. What what made him so special He's for just, you? Um, he create this type of relationship with the players that, you know, the players respect him so much. And, uh, and you know, in, in my case, I wasn't looking at him as a, just a coach, but, you know, as a, I wouldn't say as a father either, but kind of like it, mm -hmm. you know, kind of in between. And uh, somebody that you respect and uh, somebody that you want to play good for him because he deserved, you know, nothing but the best. Well, Javi, we feel the same about you. Nothing but respect and love for all of us in Braves country. Congratulations on your bobblehead night. Thank you. Don't be a stranger. Come see us a little more often, will you? <laughs> well, I'll try. All right. Javi Lopez. Thank you. 1-1 game in Atlanta.